Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Tessa, or Tessa Dama on Instagram. Make sure you're following me on Instagram. All the information is in the description box below, so make sure you're reading me. Today, I'm here for your January 2020 horoscope reading, so I hope y'all are ready. So, let's start with Aries, the first one on the chart. As a natural go-getter, you probably had your mindset on a goal for this month. Don't beat yourself up if you haven't accomplished it yet. Patience is a virtue. When you want something and you know what to do to get it, there's no such thing as failure. We know it's your patience little airy so just just slow down when you let go of that you'll find that it's probably gonna come to you right now the lesson the universe is trying to teach you is patience so just be patient that's actually probably the last thing you need to do that level up to accomplish that level up that you know is coming Taurus someone very dear to you might be struggling at the moment and that's okay you're probably gonna want to go out of your way to go and help them or go to them and heal them in some type of way which is fine but don't forget your imminent responsibilities don't forget things you have already in line for yourself oh so don't throw that out the window just because that's happening if you do decide to go help or if you decide to sit back both are an okay thing to do when you do that you might realize that the situation wasn't even that big of a deal to begin with and that person might actually tell you that that's the case Gemini so today's a day where you're gonna have a handful prepare yourself for that but also the exact same time where it's finally your chance to go and prove what it is that you've been needing to prove accomplish that check that off prove to them that you got it if you at any point start doubting yourself just take a sit back focus put that energy into the task and don't worry about anything else and you'll see that you'll, you'll, you'll be good cancer so you got plans cancer you got plans plans and that's awesome but remember what's really important about those plans. Is everyone ready for those plans? Maybe not everyone, but are they ready for those plans? What's wrong with a little bit more waiting when you've already been waiting? Might actually result in a better outcome in the end and a thousand times better memories too. Leo, you have been on it. You have been performing lately, okay? We see you. That energy and that drive has been taking over everything that you're doing. That's awesome. But remember, even you, even that, needs a little bit of a break. Remember to keep drinking your water, eat those meals, take a little time off when you've been overworking yourself, and you'll see that everything is going to continue without stop, even if you just take a little bit of relaxation time. Virgo. So your partner right now, or maybe your right-hand man, they're spazzing the out right now don't worry you guys are gonna be fine but it is going to be quite the roller coaster ride for today a little tip is just to remain calm or focus on the things that you need to do today the task at hand and don't get caught up in everything else try not to lose your temper promise it'll be over before you know it and it'll make for better teamwork later on in the future mm. Libra so you're normally Mr. Bright Idea Mrs. Bright Idea you're always on 10 you always got a new thing for everything Someone has to say, which was awesome. We love that about you. You are a genius. However, even geniuses sometimes have their bad days. Today has been that day for you, and you just, no matter what, can't seem to get back into your grind mode or your idea brainstorming mode, then just chill out. Do some type of repetitive activity that is calming and therapeutic in some type of way, whether it be knitting or pimple popping or who knows what you like to do. Come back to it tomorrow and you'll see that you'll be full of bright ideas once again. Scorpio! So a very unorthodox situation is going to present itself. You might be a little uncomfortable by it. It might need some thinking over and reconsideration. You're going to feel like you're in a tough spot, but trust yourself and remember to trust your decision-making process. Make sure to weigh out all possibilities, all perspectives, and come to your conclusion. And that'll be the best bet to keep it fair for everyone. Sagittarius. It's odd, but you may be feeling a little down right now. Your mood is just not there today. You're spending a lot of time dwelling on why this is when really, there's probably not really an answer. Don't waste any time on that. Take a minute, do some physical activity, get your blood pumping, take some fresh air, and you'll see you'll be back and ready to go by later this evening. Capricorn. A special someone you care about has finally hit you up. You are going to be in a great mood today. You're going to be on your P's and Q's. You're going to be so ready and excited for everything that is waiting in that meeting however don't forget your priorities for tomorrow and don't forget your agenda for to for tomorrow or after that you might want to take extra time and get caught up in catching up don't do that on the contrary just set up a meeting for future and cut it short tonight that way you'll still be on a good task and you've already set up future plans to get the same feeling again in the future 
Aquarius. Home might be feeling a little empty today, everybody's out and about, and you're gonna notice it. Uh, what you wanna do is take this time and start focusing on those projects you have had written down on your board for a minute. Think about those notes you've been writing that you haven't gotten to yet. Take some time and focus on your personal projects, your personal ideas, and you'll see you actually get some work done. Once you get this work done and finish this, you'll see that you'll feel a lot better and you might actually be able to entertain that little special someone you want to meet up with later tonight. And lastly, Pisces. Someone you know is not doing too hot and you're going to feel the need to help them. By all means, definitely help them if that's what you think is right. However, you know how you get Pisces, remember? to only give off that helpful positive energy and protect your internal energy. Protect yourself, protect your own feelings, and don't lose yourself in the negativity or the illness of someone else, and don't put anyone else on top of you. I hope you guys enjoyed this little reading I had for you guys. Let me know if you like this. I might do another one for February, so let me know for sure how you feel about them. Drop a comment and let me know what your sign is. If you guys can guess what my sign is or you happen to know what my sign is, go ahead and drop that in the comments or reply it to my pinned comment in the description or in the comment section below. Make sure you check out our merch. Make sure you're following us on Instagram and Twitter and streaming us on Spotify. Stream Super Bigga. He has a new single coming out in January, so make sure you tune in for that. Besides that, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, rest of your weekend, rest of your month, and remember you can achieve anything you set your mind to. I'll see you guys next time.